comes to treating this virus, right now there's a nationwide shortage of personal protective equipment. Although state health officials say Utah isn't feeling that impact yet, they're gearing up for that potential. ABC4's Jared Giacinini has the story. Now this 3D printer usually builds teeth models. But since the governor banned all non-essential dental procedures, a dentist here at Cottonwood Dental is using it to help medical personnel on the front lines of the COVID-19 pandemic. Usually pretty busy, robust day on a Thursday morning. But after the governor banned non-essential dental procedures, Dr. Cody Bozeman says he has some extra time on his hands. We have a 3D printer here in the office. Which usually prints surgical guides and teeth models. This comes off. With the current pandemic and current situation, we're not using that. So it's just been free and open. So Dr. Bozeman uh, is using the 3D printer to build face masks. That have designed these 3D printed masks. It takes about four hours to print. This is done printing. So this is what it looks like. We'll pull this print tray off. So you can kind of see how that looks. The mask is then sterilized in alcohol. And then we cured it. Um, just some elastic that we put on there to secure it. And then this is our filter material. Um, that goes over the top. Dr. Bozeman says the filter is similar to the N95 mask. We're still trying to uh, get the get the design right. And once that happens, Dr. Bozeman plans to donate these masks to people who need them. If I'm not putting my resources into into my business, it's great to be able to give back to the community. I'd love to be able to donate to them. Now, Dr. Bozeman says each one of these masks costs about five dollars, and again, takes about three to four hours to make. Jared Jatinini, ABC4 News. Thank you, Jared.